Hello, good evening, good evening, everyone. My name is Paul Ishiko for Real Day. This is a special drama film school online. Thank you so much. Today is date 70. Wow, day 70. This is awesome. This is powerful. I tell you, 20 days to go more. Well, live on the administration ground, I'm doing this in Ijebui Mushin. Well, I'm sorry if I didn't pronounce it very well. Forgive me. Uh, today is day 70, and I start with the quote Life is pleasant. Death is peaceful, but the transition that is troublesome. Isaac Amtmov, A S I M O V, Asimov. Okay, life is pleasant, death is peaceful. It is the transition that is troublesome. Hmm. Now, today's title is Transitions. I screenwriters. I want to thank God for your life in the screenplay. In screenplays, every scene is built on the previous scene. One task is in the rewrite is not only to rewrite scenes, is not to write scenes that are dynamic and specific, but also to search for ways to connect these scenes in a manner that supports the narrative, clarifies the theme, the theme, conveys meaning and delight the senses. In Stanley Kubrick's uh, 2001, A Space Odyssey, the film exploits questions of human evolution and technology, an intersection of these two elements. Mm. Thus, the film, begin, the, the film begins with possibly the most famous scene transition in cinematic history. A cabman throws a bone into the air and the following scene begins with a space a spaceship floating through outer space the bone flying into the air just opposed against the floating spaceship ignite the viewers imagination the cut spans millions of years and the effect is electrifying as we experience a vis uh, a visceral, a visceral recognition of how far we have come technologically. Are you following? Huh. Each scene climax is an opportunity. Each scene climax is an opportunity to raise the stakes, and every new scene is an opportunity to defy, uh, to defy audience expectations. This transition between them is the glue that either strengthens the, the, the true line or causes confusion in our viewer. Sometimes, that's by simply, uh, by simply moving the order of two scenes, we discover something about our story we did not know before. We are looking for a frisson between scenes and this can be found in contrasts loud or soft fast or slow gentle or rough majestic or humble we are telling a story through pictures i repeat that one we are telling a story through pictures just as the painter understands the power of negative space as we watch our movie in our mind's eyes in our mind's eye let's cons let's consider the cut between scenes what is unspoken may be more powerful than what is screamed. What is unspoken is more powerful than what is screamed. Wow. Until tomorrow, don't forget, don't just be creative, stay creative and be a person of creativity. Do have a wonderful day. Bye.